Guys, it's almost 4 o'clock in the afternoon, and I don't have anything recorded at all for the vlog. Um, I think I'm just going to call it. i got to call it on the whole thing. This is too much. I tried, but I don't think I'm going to vlog anymore. <laughs> you should have seen your face. Like he's given up that easy. Come on, have a little bit more faith in me. Let's do this. Okay, I'm up, Fife Dog. I'll be right down, Q-Tip. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Oh, hello, I didn't see you there. I was just practicing my salsa again. Round two, here we go. I'm taking you along for an up close and personal look. Remember this song from like 99? Nelly! Ooh, ooh, spooky. Ooh. Oh, whoa, the thing is bright. All right, I'm headed back into the gym. It's my first time back into the gym since the holiday break, and I'm kind of nervous. It's that strange feeling of um, just getting back into it after a long break, and I was, I was still working out at home, but I worked out at home because I didn't feel like my workouts were even gonna be worthy enough of the gym. If that makes any sense, don't live your life that way. That was really weird to think. Go Always go to the gym when you can, but uh, I just had a, a moment of tiredness this past week where I didn't even make it to the gym after work. But the most important thing is I'm back in it now and I'm just going to keep showing up. So what are you going to do this week to show up uh, and do some sort of physical activity? I would recommend it, especially getting back in after the holiday break. Good luck. We're in it together. It's just like the sunshine. Jim's rocking today. A little thriller. The wall of fame. That guy's staring me down like, work your calves. So this is the oldest gym in San Diego. Stern's Gym. I think it's been here since the 50s. You go up these stairs and get the best workout of your life. I'm sad and I'm lonely. My heart it will break. My sweet. Boom. Guess what showed up? It rained enough. Look what else the night brought out. Okay, so maybe not 1940s, but it's really old, and I think some of the equipment that's still in there to this day might be from when it first opened. But hey, it gets the job done. Also, Arnold Schwarzenegger used to work out there back in the 60s, like for one day. So yeah, I feel his presence when I work out there. Felt great to be back in the gym. I don't know why I was so worried to just go the first day I got back. The workout was great. Um, and I felt really good afterwards. I felt motivated, even more made it motivated than when I work out at home. So I should have just gone. But uh, I don't want this to get all Tony Robbins and motivational on you, but I would encourage you to, so I'll just tell my, my own story, my own personal experience, small changes add up. Making small changes throughout the day uh, and then every day add up over time. So if you start making some small changes today, by the end of the year, imagine how that snowball effect will work and how good you'll look, how good you'll feel. And uh, yeah, so I would encourage you today, 
to make even a small change if that's just working out at home for you or eating a salad, whatever it is, small changes do add up over time. Good luck.